the stark landscape and pristine mountain peaks. Frozen lakes and endless stretches of rocky barren terrain. And amidst this virgin beauty, echoes the sound of these children. हमारे स्कूल में सारे सब्जेक्ट है इंग्लिश उर्दू मैथ एस एस टी साइंस मुझे स्कूल अच्छा लगता है कि दोस्तों के साथ खेलने में अच्छा लगता है Children who can now learn, study, and play in these schools that have been practically reinvented in their villages. An initiative that has been life changing for the Ladakhis in this region. What we are really trying to do is work A, work in only the remote schools. Okay? Why? Because today there is a lack of faith in the Uh, of the parents in the remote government schools all of the schools that i talked about are government schools um since they don't they have an there is an apparent lack of faith they try and send very young kids as young as 3 and 4 years old alone to the city of leh to study which is creating an exodus of young children to try drawn to ladakh time and again for trekking sujata sahu quit her job to pursue her passion educating children and this led to the inception of 17000 feet a foundation that was set up to embark on a journey of social change a journey that aimed to transform the face of schools in the remotest villages of this region in in the remote villages the size of the villages are very very small so a anything you do there any intervention you bring in any kind of support any kind of extra effort you see you can actually see the results we didn't have to uh push them to come to school we just have to make it a whole lot better and easier for them since their inception in 2011 17000 feet has broken down their projects into modules of infrastructure upgrade teacher training resource improvement and focus and exposure through volunteer workshops we've set up libraries in over 100 schools today and what we also do is conduct reading programs to help improve their reading and english and their vocabulary we also conduct you know infrastructure improvement the schools are in pretty bad shape so they need simple things like chairs and tables something you know in in minus 10 degree temperature they're sitting on the floors so we do school furniture none of the schools we know of have playground something as basic as that we supply playgrounds we've done you know, you know repairs and so on We also are very keen on training teachers at a central level so we work with the department to train te teachers in various methodologies The initial stages of a program had their own share of hiccups With access being the biggest hurdle Sahu and her husband had a tough time mapping and assessing all the schools that were present in these remote districts of Leh We visited 370 schools when we started out we said 370 where are they so we started out we visited and mapped every single one of them we took their latitude longitude and altitudes obviously they don't have street addresses some of them don't even have roads you have to climb or walk for two days or half a day to reach the most amazing thing that we found was every of these will schools even if they had children as little a student strength of as little as one child or whether they had 100 children they were all functional उन्होंने यहाँ पे बच्चों को बड़े फन के साथ कैसे मीन्स बुक्स को यूज करना है तो यूजुअली हम करते हैं कि लाइब्रेरी यूज करते हैं वहाँ पे लिखे होते हैं प्लीज किप साइलेंस बच्चे बुक्स उठाते हैं पढ़ते जाते हैं मीन्स देट डजेंट मेक्स एनी सेंस आप इन्होंने बताया कि इनको कैसे यूज करना है और जो बुक्स को देख के बुक्स में जो जितने भी एक्टिविटीज होते हैं उनको कैसे बच्चों को बच्चों के अंदर ईगर लाना है पढ़ने की 17000 feet has still now benefited about 8000 children and with the impact becoming bigger and better this educator is all set to conquer new heights